Yeah, I was gonna say, I don't remember those. I see what I'm saying. My name is John Bossworth. They just call me Boss, but um, I'm studying uh, audio production and music business, a dual concentration in recording industry at Middle Tennessee State University. You know, that, that time in life where you need to apply for college came. And uh, I, as, as ambitious as I am now, I was then and applied to Berklee School of Music and uh, Shenandoah Conservatory was um, talking to me about coming there and um, I'd applied everywhere, uh, business schools, music schools, um, music industry programs and I, I knew that you know my, my, my purpose was to help people through music because um, I had received that uh, purpose uh, as I was kind of applying for colleges. So I, I knew which direction I needed to go, so I narrowed it down to um, you know, about 10 colleges across the United States, applied to all of them. Middle Tennessee State ended up getting my SAT scores. They accepted me and they gave me some scholarships. And uh, you know, they have a phenomenal recording industry program. Their, their mass communications or media and entertainment is top notch. So not, not only was it the only school I got into, but it was one of the best options. It was you know, completely up to me on how I would, I would learn through this recording. And, um, you know, if, if uh, Endeavor's up to me, I'm, I'm going to swing for the fences, you know. Uh, how, how can we get the most people uh, involved and benefiting is usually the way I'm thinking. You know, teamwork makes the dream work. And uh, got together with uh, a few friends and started talking, like, what's our next song we're going to record and, and how are we going to do it? And um, our, our vocalist, Alex Gibson... Uh, just throughout the idea, um, let's do Jason's song, Gave It Away. It's composed by Jason Robert Brown, a great composer, and um, let's make a video. And I had a song written. I thought I was going to do an original for the, for the project, but um, once again, the thought was how do we get more people involved and benefit, and um, to quickly get the music out and to uh, have something that is more recognizable, easy to you know, share on the internet and um, make, a, make a difference for people's personal careers. The, the recordings are, are amazing because I mean, we have you know, multi-million dollar professional studios and the availability um, to, to make professional recordings right here at school. Um, so I've really enjoyed that. Um, but. I think the coolest and most beneficial project would be simply working with uh, people like yourself in different uh, departments and, you know, taking, um, say, a class grade, a class project, and then involving um, a video shoot or involving a social media campaign, you know, use, utilizing the new media program here, or um, working with the animation students in, in uh, electronic media communications to um, create, you know, the, the games and, and visions of the, you know, the education program that I'm working on. So that, that's the, the most beneficial project for me is, is not necessarily a school project or even taking a school project and working with um, all the students in different departments. I think it was age uh, 16 where I started to take music seriously. Um, it was where I figured out that it's possible to formulate a career around music or involved with music. Because um, you know there's like outside pressures when uh, you're growing up or, or throughout your life um, to get a secure job and, and uh, you need to do what you love. I love people and I found that music is the one thing that, that can break all barriers and communicate with all people. Um, it, can, it can move people no matter their, uh, their background, or their limitations um, that they put on themselves or that society's put on them or whatever. Breaks it all down. And so I thought, what better way to help people than to use music?
the click being in.